Hello and welcome. Amid all the hustle and bustle of Marseille, we find this wonderful football theatre, the Orange Vélodrome. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere really building up nicely, we should be in for a terrific contest. It's France versus Poland. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Here's the side France will go with. Hugo Lloris is the goalkeeper. Lucas Hernandez plays alongside Rafael Varane in central defence. N'Golo Conte starts alongside Paul Pogba in central midfield. And up front, Kylian Mbappe plays with Olivier Giroud. Giroud! Couldn't hang on to the ball. France moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Magnificent defending. Goralski. Szymanyski. Can they find a gap in the defence? Well, I think a classic commentator's curse just then. Couldn't make the ideal pass. Conte. in front well a key block from Glick free kick awarded then by the referee this to make it 1-0 a goal accurate from the spot ball is moving once more how important will that opening goal prove to be Bartosz Bereszynski and Bednarek Goralski Zielinski Bielik this is Robert Lewandowski Goralski. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Griezmann. And it might be. Superb stop. Playing it in. But hang on, the flag has gone up and it's not going to count. Well, it was a close call, but he is just offside. Good finish, mind you. Lewandowski. And now Zielinski. Well, they've lost possession of the ball. I must say, this looks promising. And he takes on the shot. Well, it was straight at the keeper, but technically good goalkeeping. Mbappe just made sure nothing came of that. Well, an opportunity for France to add to their lead from this corner. Delivering it. Well, he'll be a bit deflated following that effort, but he was being tightly marked. creative look about this and the referee blows for a foul can they extend their lead goal taking aim from the spot and finding the target
Well, here's the replay, and it's taken with such confidence, isn't it? Right into the top corner, never in doubt, to be honest. Great spot kick. Well, a second goal for them here. Bielik. Goralski. Oh, splendid skill. Moving the ball nicely, looking for that final pass. Szymaniewski firing it in. You'll be hard pressed to find a better save than that. Loris. Who can they pick out? The chance is on. Could be. Oh, a moment of pure class. Had to catch it perfectly, and didn't he just? Well, here it is again, and what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it, while the movement in the box is equal to it. It's such good timing. What a goal. The first half here comes to an end. So they get the ball rolling once more, and it's advantage France after the first half. Let's see what the second 45 has in store for us. Giroud. Coman. Conte now. Griezmann. Chance to finish. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. Well, Antoine Griezmann, so far, you've got to say, excelling out there, Stuart. Well, he's been brilliant. He finished his goals really well. He's shown a great awareness of how to find space. Has eyes for goal. And he's such a highly respected goalkeeper, Hugo Lloris. Substitution time it is. Chance to set up an equaliser from the corner. And he didn't miss by a massive margin at all. Coman. Griezmann. Can he make it count? Oh, and it goes! Now he has his hat-trick. A special moment for him. Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance, and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. No shortage of goals on this match. 3-1. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. Krikoviak. Chance to do damage. Zielinski. And it's gone out of play. Goal kick coming up. Griezmann. Ben Yedder. Camille Glick with a fine challenge. And it's a quality pass. Coman. Mbappe. He's in with a chance. And it goes! Well, it's one goal. A highly impressive performance. Well, he wasn't going to waste this chance. 1v1 against the keeper, and he slots it away with great confidence. That's a good finish. So the action is restarted, and it's been a goal-scoring masterclass from France so far. You sense it's a question of how many. 
so almost at full time and the home side very much in command Stuart what have you made of their overall performance well the result has never really been in doubt has it they've created so many chances with some brilliant attacking play I think they've looked an outstanding team today well let's see what they have in store for them on the break can they keep it going and Coman has the chance a goal and I'll tell you what on this sort of form very few would lay a glove on them well here it is again and it's all about the pace in transition they're so quick to get out from the back and from there he never looked like missing that's a lovely goal It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Just ten minutes remaining here. Lewandowski. Now here's Godalski. This is Robert Lewandowski. Brilliant piece of skill. You'll be hard-pressed to find a better save than that. Loris. Can he deliver it with accuracy? But it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Conte has lost the ball. Well, possibilities in the centre. Laid into the box. Trying to chisel a chance out of it. and read the danger magnificently well if he gets this wrong a penalty and a sending off but he was spot on with his challenge and the counter attack is on options available can he put it away oh burying them beneath an avalanche of goals no let up here well let's see this again this is counter-attacking football at its very best. But I think the defending is poor. How can the goalkeeper be left so exposed with two players running at him? Mind you, it's still a great team goal. And there it 